I'm just a maintenance man. And it takes people an instant or two to tell me, no, 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 no. You're not just a maintenance man. You're much more than a maintenance man. You're, you're this. You're the other. Never say you're the maintenance man. It's almost like I'm, I offended myself. And they have to show me that I'm not just a maintenance man. They, 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 it's offensive to say I'm just a maintenance man. And it's funny because, see, we, we go through our lives with, with these titles or, or these levels of success. You know, you start school and uh, you start coloring pictures or whatever. And you, 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 the other kid colors better than this kid. Well, this kid's special. He gets a star and he gets an A. And then you go through all, all your school years and, yeah, you're the, you guys are the A students, A plus students, student of the ward every month. That's the number one students. And then, well, the other ones are just the Bs and then the Cs and well, there's the these and the F students. And we go through our lives like that, giving everybody a, a, a title or, or a place. These are better and better than those. You're not saying the other ones are bad. You're just saying they're not as good as the better ones. And, and I understand. That's that's the way life works. That that's, that's the process of life. You know, the there's a, people that are going to succeed, people that are not. And it's just the chain of life. And I have no issue with that. The issue I have is with the title. With the title. The title is, is something really tricky. Um, you go to school. You have all your friends, your peers. And years later, we're all on Facebook or whatever. And uh, I see them. And some of them own successful companies. Others are doctors and and dentists and this and the other. And uh, uh, some look very successful. Others don't. And I'm just, I'm just a maintenance guy. You know, and I love it. I have no issue with it. It, it doesn't bother me that I'm the maintenance guy and, and, and my friend that they used to be my friend in school. I mean, we're, we're still friends, but he's a successful company owner. I love it. That's good. That's good. It doesn't mean less of me or more of him because that's not how I see life. I think life is measured by the quality of life, not the money or the title you get. See, I know some landscapers, for example. That, that, that can be perfectly happy Saturday and Sunday sitting in the porch playing with their kids or their grandkids. They have time for that. They love it. I also know some really successful people that own companies and a lot of money, and they go home and they tell their wives, please don't talk to me. I have a lot on my mind. Please don't bother me. I need a rest. And their kids, dad, dad, please, please, I need some time. I need a rest. And this goes on for years. And, and, and they, they live a life like that. While the other one is... Yeah, he doesn't have the same amount of money, especially not the same title, but he's enjoying every day of his life with his kids or his grandkids. So I'm not saying one is more successful than the other one. I'm just saying the quality of life of those two people is very different. Even though one will post on Facebook their, their trips to Bahamas or Hawaii or whatever, and the other one may not never have a vacation like that, it really doesn't mean all that much. It's just something that's on our mind. Yeah, he got to go to Hawaii, and I'll never go there. Well, it doesn't matter to me. I mean, Hawaii is just another place on Earth, and I live in a place on Earth. Vacations is anywhere, everywhere. The landscaper can take a vacation every single weekend, while the other guy has to plan his vacation one time a year, maybe for a week, and spend a lot of money, and it's, it looks great. He went somewhere where the other guy's never been, but that doesn't really mean anything at all. So what I'm getting at is, a title or amount of money that you're making really is not happiness. You don't measure happiness by that. At least I don't. So when I say I'm the maintenance man, I'm perfectly happy being the maintenance man. I don't have to show up and say, oh, I'm this, and I'm the, I've done that, and I own this, and I've owned that, and I used to do this, and I used to do that, and I know how to do that. No, no, I'm just the maintenance man, and that's okay with me. If somebody says, oh, just a maintenance guy, oh, I know who I am. Nobody has to tell me. Nobody. The title that I give myself is 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 where I'm at in life right now. It doesn't bother me if one guy thinks oh, this guy's just un unclogging toilets all the time, or or, or 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 if somebody were to think, oh my god, this guy's the smartest lawyer in the world. It would make no difference. Of course, I'm not a lawyer, but if I was, it would make no difference because I know who I am. I I don't need a 
somebody telling me you're this or you're the other or you're not this or you're not the other. Having a title as a maintenance man, for me, is perfectly fine. And this goes for anybody, for a mechanic, for a janitor, for anybody that has a, a title, landscaper, a construction worker, that, that does not sound as successful as the other guy that's a lawyer or a doctor or a senator or whatever. It does not sound as successful, but there is no difference in the amount of success of one life compared to the other. If you're going to measure it by money, maybe there is a difference. But money is really not the end, end all be all of life. It, it seems like it because we're programmed to be the A plus student, but it's not. It really isn't. And neither is the title. Well, you guys have a great day.